Update queries in Access are used to add, change or delete the information in an existing record. You cannot use an update query to add new records or to delete records from a database. An update query is a type of action query that makes changes to several records at the same time. As a best practice, when creating an update query, first create a select query that identifies the records that you want to update. Then convert that query to an update query that you can run to update the records. The updated value can be the same value for all records. For example, to update the zip code for all customers with the zip code 07533 to 07510, use the update query. On the Create tab in the Queries group, click on Query Design. Add the Customers table. Add the fields Customer, ID, City, State and Zip. Use a criteria to get the records you want to update. The criteria can be in the same field. For example, in the criteria row of the zip, enter 07533, run the query. The query returns the records that you want to update. Switch to design view, click on update. Access converts the select query to an update query. Notice an update to row appears in the design grid. Specify the fields to update and how to update them. To update zip, type the value to update to in the update to row for that field. Enter 07510 under zip. You can review which values will be changed by an update query in datasheet view. Click on view and select datasheet view. The query will not run, but you will be able to see which records and fields will be updated if you run the query. Switch to Design View. Click on Run. An alert message appears showing how many records will be affected and that the changes can't be undone by the undo command. Click on S to run the query and update the data. Open the table and you can see that values in the zip code field have been updated. Once update is done, you can save the query for future use or close it. Instead of updating multiple records with one specific value, sometimes you may need to update each record individually based on an expression. The field can be updated using its own value using an expression. For example, you can create an update query to raise prices for all the wages by 10%. Open the query designer, add products and categories, add product ID, price, category ID and name. Category ID for wages is 1. In the criteria row of the category ID field, enter 1. Run the query and verify the records that you want to update. Switch back to design view and click on update. Update to row of the price field, enter this expression. Click on run and click on S to update the prices. Open the table and verify the updates. You can use any expression with an update query ranging from mathematical functions to string operations. You can update the field with a value from another field in its own record. For example, update profit to revenue minus expense and is active to false where year equal to 2021 and is active is true. Open Query Designer, add the table revenue, add the fields year, region, revenue, expense, profit and is active.
enter the criteria 2021 in year field true in is active click on update in the update to row of profit enter this expression revenue minus expense and in the is active field enter false run the query and the required records are updated you can use an update query to delete field values by using an empty string or null in the update to row to clear the values in profit from the revenue table enter null in the update to row run the query all the values from profit field are cleared if you like this video subscribe to our channel